is up you guys? I'm Charmix today. I'm gonna be reacting to Pet Cemetery 2019 trailer 2 by Paramount Pictures. Now I have no clue what Pet Cemetery is. Or at least I don't remember having a clue, so maybe I did at one point but I forgot. But uh this is a, a new trailer that's come out. I'm actually really interested in it though. It was recommended. I think uh, Philip DeFranco had it in like Today and Awesome. So I am I don't know, I I'm I'm intrigued. But anyway, let's see what this is about. Is it a horror movie? I'm kind of getting that it's a horror movie. I also saw it on, mentioned on Reddit, so I don't know. I think it's a horror movie, though. Anyway, let, let's find out. The original link's in the description. Without any further ado, let's begin. Pet Cemetery. Does this have something to do with, like, PETA? Because if you don't know, they euthanize 80% of the animals they take in. in the yeah, it's a horror movie. It's a horror movie. <laughs> Just like the, the friggin' music, like ants in the woods. It's a horror movie. Woods today. LA discovered a charming little landmark. The pet, pet cemetery. cemetery. Place to bury our pets and remember them. Might seem scary, but it's not. Perfectly natural. Just like dying is natural. The whole town's been using this place for generations, folks. Okay, so where is this? It's, it's it's a horror movie. It's got everything to a horror movie, right? Like this weird eerie sound effects and the, the atmosphere, you know, feeling to it. But where does it go downhill? Because so far it just seems like it's a cemetery in the woods. I mean, most people bury their pets, so it just seems kind of normal. Let's make a kind of ritual out of it. It's not some... So this is based on the book of by Stephen King. I've not read this, so I have no clue. <laughs> Campfire story. Saw these in the trees up there. They're warnings. The local tribes carved them before they fled. They fear that place. There's something up there. Something that dates way back. Those woods belong to something else. I, can't, I won't lie, I'm, I'm interested. I kind of want to see this. I kind of want to see this. I like horror movies, and if it's if it's directed by the same person who did It, which I think it said it is, it should be pretty good. Something. That cat was dead. It brings things back. Church. Spoilers. I'm thinking of doing. But they don't come back the same. Oh no. Who's what's going on? Hug your daughter. I should never <laughs> Bring me. Ah, uh, yeah, I like this so far. However, I think the I think the trailer actually is giving away a little bit too much information. Cause so far it's shown a lot of what happens in the movie. You know, the kid finds a cemetery. The cemetery is for buried pets. There's some weird creature on the cemetery that brings the stuff back to life. The daughter gets hit by a truck. The daughter comes back to life. That's a lot. That's a lot of spoilers. It's shown in this trailer. They gotta be careful. Otherwise, there's no point of going to see the movie when you have you give all the information. I'm showing you that place. Your child is not the only thing that will come back. The barrier is broken. <laughs> Frig me. We have a second chance. Sometimes dead is better. The old Achilles heel. April. All right, so this movie comes out in like two months. I'll say that I'm probably gonna see it. I don't know. I'm interested. I'll, I'll wait till the reviews. I don't. I don't like to waste money on seeing a movie that's rated horribly. Cause if I'm not gonna like it, what's the point, right? I'll wait till reviews come out. If it's rated good or decent, I'll probably go see it. Cause it looks. It looks interesting. It looks intriguing. And it is by Stephen King, who, who makes some pretty um, interesting novels but i think the trailer here gives way too much information on what happens in the movie because 
it basically spoiled like half of it. Because as I said, you know, it shows that the little girl finds a cemetery. It shows that the cemetery has something living in it that brings things back to life. The little girl gets hit by a truck. The little girl gets back to life. And all the other dead people are coming back to life. That's a lot of spoilers. Like, that's a lot of freaking spoilers for a trailer. So you, they gotta be careful. Otherwise, there's not gonna be a point of seeing the movie when you already gave away everything in the trailer. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys liked this. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, possibly share a friend. If you do, subscribe to the family. I'll see you guys next time.